There are currently about three and a half million people in the United States living with an autism spectrum disorder. So it's likely that you already know or are working with someone on the spectrum. ASD truly is a spectrum, which means that it affects every individual differently. No one descriptor applies to every person with an autism spectrum disorder. As a result, effective strategies for working with individuals with ASD may also vary. Here are common characteristics of individuals on the spectrum. These can represent both challenges and advantages in the workplace. Employers are always looking for the best and brightest job candidates, but due to misconceptions, individuals with ASD are sometimes overlooked. In truth, many people on the autism spectrum have qualities that employers value. Stephen was a consultant in our technical consulting group. He brought that technical ability as well as very organized and methodical approach to doing his work. My strongest passion is working in system administration and help desk work. Um, I really feel very strongly about helping others understand technology, especially when there's so much of it around and uh, so few that understand it. Steven brought with him the technical skills that the group needed. This included database skills uh, and more importantly, a lot of detail-oriented skills. What'll happen is that there'll be tasks that most people think are tedious, and yet I kind of find them fascinating because I, I have to sort of dig into them and really get involved with them. When we interviewed Forrest, he presented a lot of interest, a lot of passion, and a lot of energy, and he was a very capable programmer. Uh, so those, those aspects got him the job. They allowed me to work on projects to such a degree that I was able to exact my perfectionism upon them. I always pursued the projects that I was working on to the best possible quality that I could get them to be. A challenge a lot of programmers have is, is just, okay, I know I'm supposed to make it, but how do I make this cool? And for us, very, very um, intrinsically understood how to make this particular thing fun. We had tried several times to come up with a new standard for the way we develop GL feeds. They're usually very custom. He managed to do it, and I gave it to him because I figured he could. With his attention to detail, I knew that if anybody could do this project, it would be Steven. And he came through with flying colors. Strategies for working with an employee on the autism spectrum differ from person to person. Often, the best thing you can do as a manager, supervisor, or coworker is to discuss what works best for both of you directly with the employee. Every employee needs onboarding and special attention to, to get into their system, learning the, the environment. So for Forrest, I think he needed a little bit more than the average person. Um, so having a, a person who could kind of help them navigate the system and spend a little more extra time with them would be really helpful. Every company has its own different types of culture, right? Now, when you first come into that company, you may not be aware of how that works. And that's especially the case for me, is like I'll get in there and I may not know what to do. So having a mentor will help me to get a better perspective on how that culture works, as well as how to interact with the different tools that are placed in front of me. Communicating with Steven had to be very direct. We had to be direct about the requirements of what had to be done, and also just in our expectations of, of what needed to be done around that. The communication skills that I picked up working with Steven have carried over to the rest of the team. Our processes are better, our documentation is better, the way the team interacts is better, and a lot of that was attributed to working with Steven. After Forrest was hired, his passion and interest really came through, and he was able to use those skills to develop several games for us. I wouldn't hesitate to hire somebody on the autism spectrum. The truth is they bring skills just like anybody else, and they're very detail-oriented. I wouldn't give it a second thought.